There we go. Hello, everybody. My name is Regular Gamer Alex. Welcome back once again to Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. Oh, last episode, we battled against a lot of monks. <laughs> this temple is just completely packed full of them. Oh, excuse me. We haven't reached our first boss or mini boss of this area yet. I'm curious to see if it's who or what it's going to be. Uh oh. Okay, we got the owl. Ooh, how can I go there, though? Well, for now, let's go back over here. Try and get this one other guy. Ow! I definitely want to change this out. That will get annoying. Hey, where is he? Seriously, did he just... <clears throat> yeah, I'm not letting you beat me like that, no. Wait, what? Isn't this... Okay, yeah, that's where we came from. I was not sure, but I was a bit confused there. I'm guessing... Uh, we can't go this way to that, so... We just gotta go more up. Uh... Here we go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's not... Let's go ahead and heal. Because if I fall... Well, I die. <laughs> we'll go over there in a second. Ooh. Statues? And windmills? Oh, there's something over here. Red and white pinwheel. Wait, is this why I should give to that one guy? I mean, he was asking more for a flower, but I mean... The windmill does... Kind of look like a flower. I don't know, maybe I'm just crazy. <clears throat> Which wouldn't be that surprising. <laughs> you. What is so for. Okay. Um. Ooh, made it. That guy gone bad. Yeah, actually made it over here. The lizards. Wait. There might be more things over here. Nope. Oh, white pinwheel. Maybe this is what I need to give to uh, that one guy. I can't remember names. Where am I? <laughs> I actually don't know where I am. Monkey booze? Okay. Give a coin purse. Hello? Who's in here? What is it? One of you guys. Oh! I know exactly where we're at. Yeah, okay. We're near the demon bell. I was about to say, I know exactly where we're at. Let's travel back to... Over here. Now we can lock a little shortcut. Yeah, 
I'm not gonna spend the time fighting you. No need. Yeah, just gonna ignore y'all. There we go. Instead, we go this way. Uh. For the sake of my son, put down the sword. I will. Armored warrior. You are a fool. Okay. Uh. Wow, the amount of posture damage you just did. Dang, I tried to do a Mercury count on that one. Okay, I can't move. Okay, you're very heavily armored. Okay, so I can't. Does not really seem like I can do a Mercury counter on. Okay. I'm not even doing any actual damage to his health. Ow! I'm doing a lot of damage to my posture. We yeah, this one where I just need to do posture damage. There we go. Gotcha. Your sword cannot pierce my arm. Okay, apparently that does not work. Uh how do I fight you then? Don't understand. Do I need to like? I think I might have an idea. Do I need to like kick him off the edge? Because he's putting up quite the fight. Will this work? You can't be serious. What? Okay, let's see if I angle this right. Finally! Okay, that was interesting. Ooh, I heard that FUD. <laughs> Armored Warrior. Oh, yeah, I got enough paragraph beads now. Good. What? <clears throat> There's Pochmon priming. Okay. That was actually interesting, because you couldn't kill no through normal ways. I like that. That was different. It wasn't really the hardest, because if he didn't have strong armor, he would have died way earlier. That was interesting. I like that. A little change of pace there. The armored warrior. I approve of it. Now, upgrade the prayer beads. <clears throat> yes, sir. Fourth one. Mm-hmm. More health, more everything. That's gonna make it more easier. Well, I see as though this game is not easy. It tried, I'll give him that. Can I get in here? No? Hmm. Might be a hole on the roof. Always gotta make sure. What's the best angle to do this from? Ah, uh, there's not a hole, but there is loot. 
Just a ceramic shard, but that's still helpful. I guess can't go for that route. Monkeys? Did not mean to do that. I wonder balloons. Can I go over here? No, that's death. Yep. Eh, I was curious now. I Man, imagine if falling was instantly death in this game. Instead of just taking a good chunk of health. Uh, yeah, that worked so well. Okay, yep. <laughs> this full of ash, thank you. Some eye. Can I go into that water? Oh, there's a cart. Might be able to get a treasure scale from it. But first, okay, am I stuck on the rocks? Wait, wasn't there one more? Yep. So about that car, where is he? You. Yep. Treasure curb scale. And well, since I've gone in these treasure curbs. Wolves, where did wolves come from? Doesn't matter, wolves are dead. And those are the monkeys. That's cool. <laughs> okay. Anything up here? No loot. Uh oh, that's not good. <laughs> Take you down. Okay. Thing I couldn't do death blow on him. Is he gonna come up here any day or? Okay. You want me to fight like that? Okay. And you. This is where he lives. Can't dodge a Makiri counter, man. I just can't. Oh, it's one of those undying guys again. But this time it's different. Because you actually see the parasite. I want to die from you. 
Jeez. Hmm. And I'm dead. No, but still. Jeez. Okay. You know what? Might be better just do this. But it's not going to die, is it? It's going to come back. Because of that parasite. It's going to go back, isn't it? Yep. Ah. We really need that mortal blade. Because we could sever back. That'd be... What would happen? What would we get if we killed those guys? Some loot would be nice. Looks like there's a path up here. With more of these statues. Of course. Okay, buddy. There we go. I'm all out of spirit emblems. This just leads over here. Well, there's some regular monks. They don't even have weapons, so... There we go. Oh, that's kind of terrifying. Did not mean to do that to you, but <laughs> I'll get back to full. What item were they even guarding? Spear bloom. And what is over here? Besides this guy. Ow. Not cool. I get on top. No. Oh, uh, I'll just come back in later. Mini boss time with a lot of the mobs. Great. Let's find a sculptor idol nearby first before I fight him. He's not exactly too difficult, he's just a bit annoying. There's a endless combo attack. Okay, so there really isn't any sculptor idol nearby, so... Seems like I just need to take care of this guy. I hope I don't get too sloppy here. Mm. Just go ahead and take one of his fangs to make this at least a bit more manageable. Here we go. <laughs> Dang it. It's 
Its posture's almost gone. Oh my god, that eyes. There we go. <laughs> well, I got the prey beads from him, but the loot is even over here. Just a gunpowder. Okay, then. That's literally it. Well, I guess the prayer bee is worth it. Wait, what's this? <laughs> hmm. Well, at least the fight was enjoyable. Okay, so let's just get back to our normal progress. <laughs> I really need to get to a sculptor's idol soon. I have no healing any. I cleared almost everyone this path except for two people. We're up here. Him. Who I'm about to take out. Boom. And there's one more. That one has a shield. I'm go sugar. There we go. That went well. These monks are still... They're definitely some of the most easiest regular enemies. <laughs> I mean, they pack a heavy punch, but... They're basic glass cannons. Their posture is low and their health is low. Now that guy, that guy could be an issue. Oh my god, there's two of them back to back. Hello, Kaden. Um. Hmm. Crap, of course I still get seen. Uh, is there anything in here? Of course. Jeez, where's an idol when you need one? Stop running. <clears throat> okay, that just probably leads to death. Where's an idol? I haven't seen one in a while. And that's not good. I kind of need those to live. I'm not fighting you. Goodbye. You're annoying. Oh, and there's just a lot of these guys done dying. Finally, an idol. I might have enough skill points to get something. Let's see. Uh, the only thing really interesting to Shinobi are is maybe this one. What else? Wouldn't be bad to get this. But he's also good too. Covers posture pawn. That's not bad. Do some amount of damage to posture when attacked by aim with a sword? That'd be very helpful. I might just save out to get that one. Yeah, I'm opening this, and there they are. Yeah, how's it going, man? Yeah, I should not have opened that, huh? Where's does not open from the side? I'm not fighting you. 
Those centipede parasite fangs are just insane. <gasps> Ooh. Dragon Blood Droplet. That's helpful. Now, what is this? This is where I get the blade? It's a bell? What is with this place being obsessed with bells? <laughs> Ugh. Okay, apparently the bell transported us. Three monkeys. <coughs> One of the panels is empty. Um... Uh, hi? You friend? A five prong bell murder when rung monkeys like or to international state and the full screen landscape where the bell is rung or not. Holding screen monkeys? But I got a boss here. Okay. I don't recognize this area, so. This way? Uh. Oh, I think that's him up there. I'm literally just fighting a monkey. Okay, he's fast for a monkey. Well, monkeys are fast. Are oh, okay. Of course, that's my luck. Hmm. Maybe I need to change up my prosthetic. Oh, I never even. Oh. What would be good for this fight? Maybe this? I don't know. Or no, maybe the... These... An NPC, okay. Yet another who was lost in the halls of illusion. I believe you are on a mission. And wish to leave this place. Yes. Then you must defeat the monkeys depicted on the panels at the whole entrance. Once you have done so, the divine child's voice will reach you. Okay. Purple. The monkey in the purple kimono is the seeing monkey. He has excellent eyesight, can see great distances, and is very attentive. If he spots you, he will run immediately. He is exceedingly timid. So he's not gonna fight me? The monkey in the orange kimono is the speaking monkey. While he does not have particularly good eyesight or hearing, he makes a big fuss when he sees a threat, causing all the other monkeys to run. Oh, perhaps he merely enjoys toying with humans. Okay, what about the last one? in the green kimono is the hearing monkey. He has excellent hearing, can hear across great distances, and is very attentive. He will generally run away the moment he hears you coming, making it hard to approach. He is exceedingly timid. Okay. I do not wish to leave the halls of illusion. It is usually quiet here. Which means it is near to Nirvana in its own way. At least, that is how it feels to me. Oh yes, 
By the way, there was once someone who, like you, was on a mission. I who? believe he chased the monkeys for a while, but everything here eventually went silent. I pray that you succeed. Okay, so will any of these monkeys actually fight me? Or just run away from me? Because I can't deny I'm a bit confused. This doesn't really seem like a boss fight, it just seems like a chase. Okay. Uh. Sorry, my nose is... What the... Which monkey was that? That one isn't even wearing a kimono. Okay, yeah, I heard scattering of feet that looked behind me saw those footprints. Then something was like body blocking me. So there's a f oh the empty panel. It's not empty. It's just the monkey was invincible. Invisible. My bad. Invisible. So there was a fourth monkey. It's just one that didn't even have a kimono. So technically, there's not three monkeys. There's four. What the? I'm coming for you. Oh no, you don't. No, that one. That one. Ah, uh, great, he's getting away. What the? Um, hi. Well, here's the purple one. Looks like Mr. Runaway over here. Wait. I must have jumped up. Dang it. What, what the, which one is this? Oh. This is the one of them, it's just a, a mob, an enemy. You're not leaving me. Okay, there's still one more. Finally! Was that it? I guess so. That boss fight was kinda lame. Please, forgive them. No, it was a lame boss fight. That was very lame. They only sought to keep me hidden. By not fighting at all against me? However, it seems it was not meant to be. Mate, you should have got the guardian ape to Will guard you instead. Let us meet at the inner sanctum. Seriously, I must admit, that boss fight was easy, simple, kind of boring. <laughs> I mean, after fighting bosses like Lady Butterfly, Genichiro, Guardian Ape, that boss fight was very lame and lackluster in comparison. I mean, it's unique, I'll give it that, but that's about it. Screen Monkeys, yeah, this was a straight boss. Guardian Ape Hall Illusion, Refrained Ape Divine Child of Rejuvenation. Puppeteer Ninjutsu. Interesting. Okay, so I can get my own... My own ally by backstabbing someone. Go to Hall's Illusion, no thank you. <laughs> I'm guessing you're a divine child. 
Yeah, well, at least the monkeys can help upgrade my attack power. Ritual betwixt life and death. Depart soul to your divine children drift in sway, taking shelter in the monkeys of the temple. Touched by divine child of Richard speaks to him as friends. Okay. They were still a rather lame boss fight, but still. Why do you seek this place? I want the mortal blade. Mm-hmm. Do you know of the blade that cannot be drawn? Yes. It is so called, for not one who has drawn it has ever survived. Yet you still wish to attempt this. To be fair, I can revive. I can be I resurrected. I see. Very well. If you are prepared, you may gaze upon the blade. So it kills anyone who opens it. But what if you're someone who can be revived? Why is it, I wonder? Are they not loath to die? <laughs> yep. How are you? Let's just say we're our own oh. form of undying. <laughs> You carry the curse of the dragon's heritage. Mm hmm. The mortal blade. Without question. Ooh. I accept its power. We'll be in a dachi capable of slaying the undying. Its crimson blade will take the life of anyone who draw dare draws it. Out of power of resurrection, one cannot hope to yield this weapon. We also want to defeat even infested beings. Long Sylvan Sinbao Temple. Her name, Gracious Gift of Tears. I see you serve the divine heir of the dragon's heritage. Yep. Yes. Why do you seek the mortal blade? I wish to obtain the dragon tears from the divine realm to sever the ties of immortality. I mm -hmm. see. I have read about this. I have read there is a way to sever the dragon's heritage. Mm. Which means, the Divine Heir begrudges the power of the Dragon's heritage. That's right. How strange fate can be. I am one of the children of the Rejuvenating Waters, created by those who would stop at nothing to achieve immortality. My false Dragon's blood was created by man. Children? So there are many of you. I am the only one who survived the process. The others mm. are laid to rest here. I see. I do not know if it is right to sever the ties of immortality, but the dragon's heritage undeniably corrupts the lives of men. Yeah, the dragon rot. I share the heir's feelings about that truth. Shinobi of the divine heir, I have decided to assist you. Please hold out your hand. What? Bless us with bountiful harvest. R rice? Okay, this thank you. Rice? There you are. Rice is a precious thing. It tastes better the more you eat it. And restores one's vigor. Thank you, I guess. Well, we got the mortal blade, so... That's good. <laughs> Though I still think that boss fight against the monkeys was lame and lackluster. But, have we got the mortal blade. Ninjutsu. Interesting. Might get that a try. Mortal draw, grace. Within a flash sword, she blade slashes through enemies, leaving a reddish black Noxus mist. Being mist extends range blade. It cannot be drawn if he'd only dove. L plus R1, then R1 again. Draw on a blade, cut through enemies with extended range sword attack. Alright, don't mind giving that a try. I can't use it because I'm not in combat right now. Well, before we head back to Koro, let's try and find like a quick enemy to fight using this. Let's like see how good it is.
What's a place that has like an enemy right in front of it? Here we go. This over here has one of the bow guys. L1, R1, then R1 again. Okay. Okay, maybe I should down maybe a tougher enemy. <laughs> well, I've we finally got the big thing we wanted. So for now, this is where I'm going to end this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe since it supports me and the channel. And if you guys have any gaming recommendations at all, do leave it in the comments down below. But until then, I'll see you guys next video. Stay awesome.